we're down here at the slab and I know, I know before you say anything, it's the hottest point of the day and probably gonna get a little bit hotter, but hey, we just gotta get the work done regardless of what the temperature is. So we're down here to spray these containers with a self etching primer to stop the surface rust, as you can see, that's on some of these areas and get them ready for our next phase, which is going to be paint. So I brought you guys down here to watch me through this process gonna figure out a way to establish this GoPro, maybe hold it and spray, whatever. It's not gonna be too hard. But we're gonna see how this product also works out and helping us get this done on container one and container two and get them ready for paint. So this is a fun endeavor. This is a DIY endeavor. Uh, we've done tons of research. We've done tons of planning and we've heard tons of complaints from others. Won't say any names. And uh, we're ready to go ahead and knock this stuff out and uh, get these things ready for greatness. So we've got a gallon of this great product called Ospo and we're gonna see if it does exactly as it says it can do and uh, get this taken care of for us. So let's get started with the process. All right, what we have here by a company called Skyco is Ospo. It is a stop rust, prepares rusted surfaces for painting, which is what we're getting ready for. So, read the directions here bam we've got our roundup here our roundup uh sprayer we're gonna dump this whole gallon into here and we're gonna get busy so we'll do a time lapse and we're gonna get to it All right, we've concluded our treatment in with what seems to be, and I'm no chemist or, excuse me for all the spinning, I'm no chemist or super smart guru of what things are, but this smells like essentially green colored vinegar. Um, supposed to let it sit 24 hours. We're gonna do that. We're gonna come back out tomorrow, see how it takes and see if we need to get another gallon and maybe apply to a automotive product that we have going on. But just kind of let you see how it looks now after one treatment, you can see those on the back. It's really thick, somewhat thick enough to work in a sprayer, but it doesn't just evaporate when heat or sun hits it. You can see the discoloration over all the rust and get on those spots. Container one was lightly rusted. Container two had a little bit more on the, uh, rusted side, but just surface rust, nothing real crazy. As you can see, that was kind of tan. I mean, I'm sorry, rusted real bad. So we hit both sides of that, went all the way down with that as well. So we'll come back out tomorrow, see how it looks, see if we're ready for paint. Before we paint, we're gonna definitely get some doors on here. A few other things, so stay tuned for more. This is From the Ground Up. I'm Eddie Wright of Eddie Wright Barbecue, and this is The Slab. Come with us on our journey as we build Mississippi's newest patio barbecue endeavor using our brains and your support. See you guys soon. We are back, actually on our regular food trucking day. We're about to check on the containers and let you guys see the results of the treatment that we did. And I will have to say, I am impressed with this product. You can see everywhere we put it, it did leave like an oily type residue, which is fine by me, but it's doing exactly what it said it did. It changes the surface rust to black and gets it ready for paint. Uh, this is awesome, in my opinion. This is exactly as we wanted it to be. You can tell the difference from the areas we sprayed that required treatment. We ran tan a little bit toward the end here, but that is okay. We may get a second gallon to do it all over again and make it even better before we slap this beautiful red paint on these containers. So stay tuned. Thank you guys for supporting and thank you guys for watching. We're about to get this thing live 
and are ready for you to come see us. Thank you guys for tuning in. This is From the Ground Up. My name is Eddie Wright, and with your support, we're going to be great. See you guys soon.